Grenades out! Let's go! Safe and sound at home again. At home. What is wrong? Save some for later. We're late. The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? No, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate, Hope. William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. Thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rod so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my research anymore. See 
that strange stuff in Benjamin Franklin's garden. I keep well here at that place. They say that man messes with lightning. Speaking of lightning, I reckon there's a storm coming. Aye, let's hope she demures until we're off duty. Hey, darling, you up for a pint? Sure, if you bring your maid. That last of it. Yes, it is, sir. Good. Put it with the rest. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. The storms get worse. Let's hurry back to Franklin. Shay, thank goodness! Uh, quick! Help me with the rods!
a map. Where is that? Portugal. Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right. Mount Vernon. Hope will be expecting me. Lisbon is near as large as London or Paris. Are you sure you can find this one place? Saw it clear as day, Hope. It's a convent, right close by the harbor. I might have visited the sisters once or twice. Given your present knowledge of the site, this duty falls upon you. You understand what must be done? Find the Precursor Temple and retrieve the Peace of Eden. Finally obtained a ship for crossing the ocean. Have no worries. I will keep the Morrigan safe in New York. Thank you. Liam and I will leave straight away. Liam is unavailable at present. Your crew and ship await. Be careful, Shay. Pieces of Eden are powerful relics. Feast of all saints. What a sight. And here I am, looking for a relic from the time before Adam and Eve. <laughs> Strange days indeed. Benedictus est, Domine, Deus Universi, quia de tua largitate acepimus pinum. Quod tibi offerimus, fructum vitis et operis manum momini, ex quo nobis fiet potus spiritualis. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Gracia Domini nostri Jesu Christi, et caritas Dei, et comunicatio Sancti.
Jesucriste, tu disisti apostolis tuis, pacem relinquo bobis, pacem meam to bobis. Me respicias pecata nostra, et fidem ecclesia et tuae. Eamque secundum volcatem tua, pacificare et quadunare digneris. Qui vivis et regnas in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Pax domini sit semper bobiscum. What do we have here? The artifact.
do this to them? God had nothing to do with this. So what's the next city you want me to smite? What happened in Haiti, happened in Portugal. A great earthquake, thousands dead thanks to your damned manuscript. This cannot be. Jay, a person cannot start an earthquake. A person meddling with these precursor machines could. You saw the box, Hope. The temple was filled to bursting with that kind of power. You made me slaughter innocents. How dare you? You defend him? Achilles sent me in there like Machandal sent his man in Haiti. What the he hell's knew. going on? Stop this! The operation was delicate. Perhaps you... You are shifting the earth itself. Who are you to decide what city falls next? Get him out of here. Liam is a fool if he thinks I'll leave this be. Achilles cannot be trusted. He must never find another Precursor Temple. I don't care that he's Mentor, or that his family is dead. There's no excuse for this level of madness. One thing to do. There's no turning back now. I had such hopes for you, Shay. Achilles, I have to do this. And what is it you're doing exactly? Stealing from your brothers? Betraying me? Someone must make amends. Make amends? You have no idea what you're doing. The future of the whole continent, maybe the whole world, is tied up in that manuscript. Perhaps. But we don't have the right to decide that future. The right? We have the responsibility! We are responsible for killing innocents and destroying cities. This mad grab for power. It ends now. I will not let you destroy everything we have built! <laughs> Stop him! Stop Shay!
That's enough. Give back the manuscript, Shay. I'm sure Achilles... I cannot! I will not let this happen again. All those souls lost. One more hardly matters. Shay! Glitch in the memories. There seems to be more data. Okay, Numskull. I can't pull you out of the chair right now. You'll just have to see this through. This is bizarre. These memories seem to take place some 20 years after the one we just saw. Are you certain? Positive. This means... Shay must have survived that fall. If he is the man I believe him to be, then he has. Keep going. The data is fragmented. This memory is incomplete. Let me see what I can do. Listen up. We need to find out what Shay's up to. This memory's gonna look a little rough. But I'm like 90% sure sequencing this memory won't kill you. Alright, Namsa. We don't know where Shay is or what he's doing now. So keep your eyes and ears open. I want to know the reason Shay came to this place. You heard the man. Let's move. Ugh! <laughs> 
Ouais, je suis prends, mais ils ont tout. Quoi Ça va m'empêcher de songer à ce terrible tremblement de terre. Ouais, Benjamin Franklin est à Notre-Dame. Si on se magne, on devrait le rattraper. Arrêtez de vous branler Allons-y Benjamin Franklin. That's who she is after. Franklin traveled to England and France. And that guy said Notre-Dame. She must be in Paris. Time to show me what you got. Eliminate the threat. Protect Franklin. Cette fois. Shit. What happened? That's all the data we have. We can't explore this memory further. For now. She couldn't have died, then appeared in France 20 years later. We're missing something. Shay's memories are scattered in chunks throughout the cloud. The servers are messed up from the virus, so we can't access all of Shay's life at once. orders, and my orders are to stand right here. Shay Cormac is an assassin. But he is unlike the ones you have used for your entertainment products in the past. I believe Shay may be the most important assassin who ever lived. Your research will help me achieve something I have wanted for a very long time. Shay's story may have something to offer you as well. This is another server we can access to get to the next chunk of Shade Memories. Excellent. I'm gonna need numbskull back if we're gonna proceed. Your next task is clear. But please reflect. Tired of waiting for Melanie's stupid repair crew, so I got this piece of shit working well enough to get you to the lobby and back. I'll get your enemies prepped while you're downstairs. Shit! I forgot. The server's by the level one security lock. I have granted you level one security clearance. I trust there will be no further delays. Great! Now you can get into the server room. Once you restore the servers, I'll load the next set of Shay's memories to your enemies. All points ready. Begin. Go, go, go!
Who are you? Don't you touch her! Oh, for God's sake, restrain him! You, give me the child. Oh, shush now. You all right? Elena! Calm down, Mr. Berg. I promise you I won't hurt your daughter. Who are you? My name is Warren Vidic. I work for Abstergo Industries. You quit the Uti Yaga Regiment and became a freelance mercenary in order to afford better care for Elena's cystic fibrosis. How's that working out for you? Arkele! I have an offer for you. I don't work for people I don't know. It's not that kind of offer. I'm going to remove an item from my pocket. What is that? This little pill? <laughs> it's actually for her. Go on, little one. Have some medicine. Stop! There now. Isn't that better? This... Great job, Nuskull. Data we have is pretty raw, but it's enough to move forward. Get back up here. Double time. It looks like restoring servers also clears the virus from some of the other systems. You are making excellent progress. I am eager to see what Shay will show us next. Level 1 clearance will also let you into some of the other parts of the building as well, if you need to stretch your legs in between animus sessions.
If I said that was the craziest shit I'd ever seen, would that be the most obvious statement ever? Shay has been through a severely traumatic experience. Okay. Second most obvious statement ever. Continue exploring his memories. The best is yet to come. to see you're feeling better thank you uh, mr finnegan was it sweet mother mary have we taken in the village idiot barry remember shay i'm cassidy and this is barry you've been ill for weeks i hate to have been a burden see he's a civilized fella i for a clumsy deckhand probably fell off his ship half drunk Barry! He's right. What do y'all want? Ah! Ah! What's going on? How dare you! Shut up, woman! Oh. Leave her alone! Ah. Now what are you going on about? Stay out of this, you fool! But I was going to, but... Now you've made things personal. You are mine! <laughs> 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 Thank you, Shay. In my younger days, I could have taken them one-handed. Why were these men bothering you? Ah, oh, the usual. They feel they're owed money because they're not harming citizens. Mark me words, those gangs are going to be the downfall of this city. Wait here, I have something for you. It won't do you any good walking around Starkers. Here, try these on. They were our sons. I suppose if you're looking for trouble, you'll be needing these. Thank you. Don't you look a right, gentleman? Yes. Did I have a book with me? Mm, just those peculiar weapons. Thank you both. If you'll excuse me. The manuscript is at the bottom of the Atlantic.
What have you and your friends got against the Finnegans? Uh, I got no gripe. Uh, my boss sent me over. Huh. And where is he set up? You can't miss it. There's always black smoke rising from the courtyard of that building.
before you have to. Difficult for yourself. Don't make this difficult for yourselves. Don't make this difficult for yourselves. Make this difficult for yourselves.
We must live to fight another day! That's under close. Let us investigate. Will help us smoke. Be at ease, Master Cormac. We are friends. The Finnegans were worried you might take matters into your own hands. I am Colonel George Monroe. Colonel? I came to help, but I see I am late. Thank you for dealing with these foul criminals. They were a blight on New York. What do you care? You redcoats are nothing but landlords. The townsfolk here are grinding away, trying to make a living. I cannot blame you for having that impression. Some of my comrades have been less than helpful. But I take a different approach. And what is that? I care. I want to see these colonists safe and prosperous. Noble words. Perhaps actions will convince you otherwise, Master Cormac. Here, reclaim what they have stolen. Now let us use some of that money for the good of the city. I realize you have no reason to trust me, Master Cormac. You said you were a friend of the Finnegans. I am. Their late son worked for me. You are much like him. How so? He cared. And he wanted to do good by the people. We shared a dream, he and I. That of making the world a better place. Mere survival is not enough. Full bellies, warm clothing. Freedom from want is the greatest freedom of all. It almost sounds like you have goodwill towards the people you govern. I do not govern. Master Cormac. I merely assist. General Edward Braddock, affectionately called the Bulldog. No, See this neglected edifice, Master Cormac? We can make it. Urban renewal is a new science, but one that has already proven effective on the continent. I have arranged for resources. Use them to improve that building. We're ready. I suspect New York will prosper under your watch, Master Cormac. You can do great things for this city and its citizens. After all, a man needs purpose. Farewell for now, Master Cormac.
The Colonel strikes me as an honorable man. Someone who wants to do what's right. And he may have a point. With everything that has happened. With what I've done. I can't change the past. But maybe there's a future for me here. And maybe, just maybe, I can do what's right this time. I should head back to the Finnegans. Let them know I'm fine. Shay! Colonel Monroe told us what happened. You, sir, are a fool. But thanks. <laughs> Master Cormac, I am sorry to bother you when you were barely out of your sick bed. No, I... I've had enough of being cooped up. Then perhaps you could get a friend of mine out of trouble. He discovered a nest of criminals developing strange weapons. Look at these. Bullets as loud and bright as firecrackers. If we might have a moment alone. His name is Christopher Gist, and he might be in over his head. I fear these brutes will hang him like a dog. I will not let those outlaws have another victim. Good. The villains are entrenched at Old Fort Arsenal. I have urgent business in Albany. Please tell Master Gist to join me there. Do you hear, dearie? They are hanging a man in the old fort. Oh, it would be a shame to miss that. <laughs> Did you hear, dearie? They are hanging a man in the old forge. Oh, it would be a shame. Under <laughs> 
Christopher Guest. I'm Shay Cormac. Can't! But what are you doing here, if you don't mind me asking? The Colonel sent me. Aha! Good show, Shay. Ran them right out of their own dead. Well, I was looking for a new place to live. Well, don't put your name on the door yet. There may be a few men left on their ship. Look, the bird is nested right over there. The Morgan? What is she doing there? That's my ship, friend. Begging your pardon, but I must go fetch her back from those louts. Oh, wait! I can hardly let you do that alone. Help me if you can, then. Keep your wits about you, Shay. Criminals are everywhere. And most of them look just like law-abiding citizens. And they've been harassing the people who've nursed me back to health. Sounds like good folks. They are. Perhaps you know them. Barry and Cassidy Finnegan. I've never met them, but I knew their son. Careful now. These ruffians can be anywhere. You can draw them out by making noise. Oh, I've got something better than that. Well, you seem to be more than capable of taking care of this matter. Tell you what, I shall find a new crew for your vessel. In case you have to leave, okay.
Absolutely not! Come back here right this instant! She's a fine ship. And true to my word, I found a crew for her. I did leave one position unfilled, though. Tell me, Shay, do you have a first mate? He's long gone. Then I apply for the post, Captain. Well, come aboard. As your first mate, may I suggest our next destination? The Colonel will be expecting me to report back. My thoughts exactly. Colonel Monroe said he'd be in Albany. Splendid! The Colonel waits on Albany. I wonder what he has in mind for us to do...
In good health, I see. Yeah, thanks for the captain here. It is a fine vessel, Captain Cormac. Thank you, Colonel Monroe. Master Gist, did you learn more about our conspirators and their new weapons? Well, only that their base of operations is a French fort further down river. It's a little close for comfort, isn't it? If the French have installed a fort in our territory, they are likely preparing an assault. New York could burn. Will you join us, Master Cormac? Aye. Enough innocents have died already. Uh, might I suggest we improve our vessel? The Morrigan is good, but with a few more supplies, she could be unstoppable. And yeah, there's a French outpost nearby I happen to know. I like the sound of that. <laughs> 